Welcome to Crafty Hints. I'm Chantel. If you aren't a subscriber, I invite you to subscribe today as we make this quick and easy DIY. I got all of these items from the Dollar Tree. We'll be making this wonderful framed art from a gift bag from the Dollar Tree. I also bought some lights and a picture frame. So simple enough, we'll put this together. I also had some fairy lights that I had bought off of Amazon. Now to put this together, you're going to simply take apart the frame. And then what you will do is use the glass to trace the size of the frame. So this is just quick and easy here. And of course, we'll just remove these handles so that we can use those on another project at another time. So simply cut this out. And you want to stay just inside those lines, as I learned, because I did need to go back and do just a little bit of trimming. So stay just inside that line and you should be good to go. And here's where I'm trying to decide which lights will be best. I tried first the LED lights and then I tried the fairy, fairy lights, um, but those are quite long. So I decided on the LED lights um, because they would light up the tail lights just a little bit better also. And then I placed them underneath the trees as though the moonlight or the sunlight there is shining on them. I do suggest deciding which side you will want the battery pack on. So instead of starting on this side, I would have actually started on the other side as I normally like to put the battery pack on the kickstand on the back of the frame. But that's definitely up to you and just make sure you start that with the last two lights. I've done this on several different frames. It works well on like the Thomas Kincaid where you've got the little cottage and the snowman and the lamp post. It works on so many gift bags. So I'll probably do a couple more this year just to give you a variety and a couple of ideas. But basically you're just going to tape these down where you'd like the light to shine through. If you really wanted to, you could punch little holes through where the tail lights are. That's definitely up to you. to it. You could definitely use regular scotch tape as well. I didn't have it handy and I do know that that packing tape keeps it very secure. So that's what I used and all you've got to do is glue your battery pack on the back of your frame and you're good to go. hope that you're enjoying this video and that you've hit the like and the subscribe. I'd love to have you join us with all of our holiday DIYs and our farmhouse home decor. So join us. All right and see here we are. This is it without the lights on and it looks nice just framed just like that. But here it is with just the room lights and then I turned off those lights 
and this is what it looks like this is back with another light on just so you can see it just a little more close up I think it looks amazing it doesn't look like I spent oh let's see with the lights and the frame that's two dollars half a bag two dollars and fifty cents thank you so much for watching this video